city of crime and all chaos. right welcome in all welcome no. in thank you for joining saturday night we're on reina my redeemed paladin in boulders gate three so welcome in welcome in I'm gonna turn down the volume a little bit here since it's going directly into my ears and uh, we'll get going here and a little bit so welcome in all and welcome in on uh youtube and stuff like that thanks for joining the youtube short streams and uh still kind of getting used to the vertical format looks like we're doing okay uh oh maybe all right there we go looks like I do have a bit of a looks like I do have a bit of a delay on the other side of the house but that's okay so there we go yeah it's about a 15 second delay all right so we are going to go and uh, let me adjust my microphone a little bit finish up this quest here Let's see. Avenge the Drown. Find the Secret Command Center. Rescue the Duke and stuff like that. But uh, welcome in all. So it's kind of a new feature on YouTube. And uh, I'm not supposed to mention YouTube on multi-streaming while on Twitch. But I just don't give a shit. And i um, tired of their censorship anyway. So we're going to go ahead and just get going here. And uh, it's probably going to be a little bit of an interesting stream tonight. And just sit back and enjoy it. I'll probably get on my soapbox on a couple of issues. And um, yeah. So it's, today has been kind of like a fifth Monday. So I was doing some work in the backyard today and um, working on some stuff, spilled some oil on the concrete. So yeah, it's been kind of, uh, it's been kind of rough. It's been like a Monday. Got a letter in the letter in the mail that uh, my electricity cost is going to go up by another $35. So um well, I'm on equal pay, but my equal pay has gone up. So pretty much in 2020, when Trump was still in office, I, I was paying about 25, maybe $30 a month on equal pay. And just the past four years, it's gone up and up and up. Uh, last year, like it mommy, went mommy. up. It's all right. It's all right, then, Rob. Hey, hey, welcome in, dude. Glad you're here, man. Just explaining my dilemma about energy costs and stuff like that. And, uh... Yeah. So, yeah, well, so it stabilized at right around, you know, $62 for the year. Then all of a sudden I get a letter in the mail from my uh, electricity company that they're raising it another $35. And it's, uh, yeah, so it just kind of made me cranky. What would I do after I won a lottery? I would disappear. I literally would go and if it's a big lottery, like a couple million and stuff like that, pay off my house, pay off my truck, get out of debt. And, um, buy myself some acreage, some land with nobody around and be the full-on introvert that I am and um yeah, just pretty much disappear I'd retire you know and after that shoot I, I might I just might let my select friends come visit me But, um, 
Yeah, just, just, yeah, so I'm kind of cranky a little bit here. You know, talking to another streamer earlier, you know, if you're tired and stuff like that, you know, and if you're not 100% on your stream, what, you know, what would I do? Well, you know, most of the time I'm running around probably about 75, 80% energy. And uh, yes, I am streaming on YouTube also on their uh, shorts feed. So, um, and yeah, so YouTube has decided to compete with TikTok and they are, they have gone vertical formatting and, um, I, I got invited to the pretty much the YouTube short program to kind of, um, test drive it so uh, here we are and I have no idea where I'm going in the game hey okay. but anyway so first things first we got to talk to Shadowheart here so a little bit of background on the game it's basically based off of Dungeons and Dragons Better not. They haven't even paid us for shipment. Why, hello, lover. <laughs> that sounded more debonair in my head, I'll admit. Do you need something? Uh, let's see. Yes. Of course. <sighs> of course, we're gonna get a. I suppose you've kissed from Shadowheart. She's our main squeeze in the game, you know. So it's just kind of the way my life is. I'm kind of a. You know, the, the the ones that are kind of jacked up in the head are just kind of the ones that, you know, are the fun ones to be around. All right. Got that out of the way. Uh, let's see. We got to go back this way. Another step forward. So, so, yeah, it's nothing like having your utility bills go up every single year. And uh, I just tired of it. So if you're here in the U.S., make sure you get out and vote. Vote early. Um, it's important you do that. Uh, we don't need another four years of failure like we've had here in the United States. The singing loot. Hmm. That's a bar. Uh, let's see, I am having a whiskey tonight to... Hey, hey, hey! Thanks, Wyatt, man. It is Halloween. The boss, yes. Thanks, Wyatt. Oh. Get off my property. Oh, let's see. That's no way to talk to a paying customer. Can I get something to drink? See, that's me. I'm the grumpy bartender. It's a bleeder. Uh, do it yourself. Dang. Talk about, I thought I was cranky. Holy crap. He's definitely cranky. What? Oh. Bartender doesn't have... Yeah, with that attitude, no wonder he doesn't have any customers. Uh... No, no, I have not. <laughs> and, uh,
yeah and for you trolls out there um here, we're just going to continue on with the stream and i'm just going to ban your ass so yeah so you, you trolls that are coming into the other stream uh, and just trying to give me a hard time um gfy as elon would say and you're just going to get busted and removed <clears throat> I was just starting to miss the sound of your voice. Hey, hey. Welcome in, Australia. Glad you're here, man. Welcome in. <laughs> so pretty much I'm a one-man show here. So if I uh, stop kind of midstream, it's just basically mean I'm, I'm taking care of some trolls on the other side of the house. So... Um... So we got to get into this warehouse. Let's see if we can sneak in. What's on your mind? Uh, nothing right now, Gail. Let's, uh, Let's see, my favorite mod. Uh, I like, I like, I like the angel wings, and I also like the um, costume packs. They're 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 really cool. Um, unfortunately, when Larian did their patch seven, it broke a lot of mods and stuff. Hey, Lord, welcome in. So how's everybody doing? Let's have a look. Oop, don't want to steal that. Blood? No. Oil. Leading right inside. Hmm. So somehow we're gonna have to sneak in there. Hey Lord Wink up, how you doing? I would say I like the cosmetic packs that you can get from uh, Nexus mods and also in the in-game mod manager. You know, just I have to I have to say that Larian did leave out a lot of good stuff when you, when they first published the game. So it was kind of nice that the. Uh, modding community came together and um, uh, created the mods. Nice. So what are you going to be uh, nice, Lord? What, what are you going to be um, playing? We have to go there. Oh, that'll work. Nice. Okay. So we don't get in trouble. Oh, I have the magic touch. I'm going to use Gale's knock. <laughs> Final Fantasy 14, nice. You know, that's cool. Yeah, I've, I've tried that a couple of times. I have a couple of characters on some servers over there. I just don't remember, you know. 
Hey, that Matt. How you doing, man? Welcome in. Welcome in. Thanks, all takes. As to your question, how much free time do I usually have? Nice. Thanks, CV. Back to the main question. How much time do I usually have? Not much. Between streaming on Saturday night and working a full-time job during the day and doing content during the other time, uh, not much. Thanks, all. Hey, CB, glad you and your girlfriend are watching it. Have I got any special voice making lessons? Uh, nope, not really. Ah, well, thank you, uh, thank you, Rick Nav Navo. More tags, appreciate the advice. Oh, yes. Uh, let's see. I also play. You're absolutely right, Lord Wing. I'd say I also play ESO and also Star Trek Online. So it, it's, yeah. Basically, these games are time sinks. And uh, with everything else. Not much free time left. Intestines throb, blood whispers. Easy, Raina. So I usually stream for about two hours on um, Saturday night. Rest of the week, like I say, is full time job. And um... hey, what? Thanks, man. Hey, Holy MP. Nice. How, how you doing tonight? What do you think? All right. So on my Twitch channel, uh, let's see. I've got people asking me some questions here. Uh, what do you think about your future? Are you planning to stream tomorrow? Uh, no, basically my streaming schedule is uh, Saturday nights, 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time. Um, I just don't have the free time to do that and um ooh, bad guy alert moving ahead and the rest of the time like i said i'm working a full-time job and also doing content creation i'm wondering if we can drop a nasty on them i don't need any attention right now all right let's get on our wizard over here Uh, By my oath, get you out of their sight, Velkin. All right. Hey, emo. Good to see you, man. Hey, William. Thanks for gifting that sub to someone. Let's see if we can. Oh, thank Thanks for the hype train all. Hey, hey, oh yeah. Mayonnaise, welcome in. Yeah, I've played D&D. &D. I was one of those guys at the uh, lunch tables uh, rolling dice or over in the corner during, you know, middle school and high school that uh, did play D&D. &D. So this is kind of like really cool for me. All right, what do we got wizard wise? Something big and powerful. All righty. Thank you, thank you, thank you.
Hey, yeah, I'm streaming Baldur's Gate 3 today. And uh, I'm on Reyna. She's a paladin. And she's redeemed herself. So she's a good paladin now. So, yeah, during high school, I played D&D. &D, middle school, played d and I was the guy that was, was with the little, little group of people over in the corner. And, uh, yeah, so I'm pretty familiar with the D&D &D stuff, obviously, over the years. Nice. Th thank you. All right. What can we drop on these guys? Four, four. Oh, yeah. Make sure we get all of them. Now we've done it. We, we've, we've. Piss them off. Oh, there's the music. Sound effects are awesome. So, uh, yeah, basically. Hey, Zet. Welcome in, man. Get the modifier there because they're on ice, which is water. Uh, no, I don't speak Portuguese. And let's see. Oh, yeah. Let's see if we can get these guys. Nice. Nice shot, Gail. You're actually worth something tonight. Nice, nice. All right, what does he got left? He don't got much left. All right, poke him in the eye, Gail. Nice. Oh, shit. Still one left. I'm good with that. I might need that one for later. Let's cook them. Hey, Earth. Welcome in, man. Let's see. Just getting caught up on chat here really quick. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, so you can hit me up on uh, Twitch inbox. Send me a message to Twitch. Hey, holy MP. Uh, what do I love about the game? Well, it never gets boring. And then the thing about it is there's always... Nice. Thank you. Um, it never gets boring. There's always something new that... Uh... Mm -hmm. something new that happens in the game something new i always find you know thanks again wyatt appreciate that william and stuff welcome in oh wow thanks william appreciate that also again and So yeah, if you want to contact me, just contact me through Twitch inbox. Send me a message there and I can get back to you. <sighs> Trying to get caught up here a bit. Hey, hey, thank you for the Twitch sub. Hey, Sophie. Yeah, man. Most of the time, Gail misses the first shot or the second shot, and, and you're just like kind of toned at that moment. And, and uh, 
So when he hits, it's like a small victory. It's like, yes, you know? So right now we're trying to figure out... Bother. You know... Ash and meat. Uh, avenge the mermaid people, the you know? So, uh, what do you end up playing, Soapy? Do you, like, uh, play a wizard, paladin, dark urge? Oh, we're gonna loot this place. Look at all these loots. <laughs> so, yeah, um... Thanks, what? Yeah, I gotta forewarn everybody. I am a loot goblin. I like to stop and uh, not smell the flowers, but stop and loot everything. Right, Raina? So Raina was the dark urge, and uh, she ref through. She refuted. Oh, there we What's go. That? She refuted ball. Ah, healing roll and stuff, and uh, extra damage. I get it. I'm I'm more of a uh, tanky type of person. Orcaster. I got a lot of uh, sorcerer warlocks. <laughs> maybe I'll maybe I'll maybe I'll download the uh, maybe I'll download the. Uh, Hey, hey, thanks, Rabalsk. Appreciate that. Maybe I'll download the Bard class after this and give it a whirl. Never played one. I've always played casters or, you know, fighters type of deal. Might be interesting. Uh, congrats, Williams. Thanks, man. I appreciate that. I'm sure everybody that you've gifted to appreciates it, too. So, thank you. I... Yep. I think we do have a winner. I was just starting to miss the sound of your voice. Hey, ye. I don't know. I mean, I've already got I've already got enough eye problems as is. I don't know if I could have a tadpole behind there, you know? It might fi fix my stigmatism in my eye though. But um I I don't know. I don't I don't think so. I mean, just totally not having any control um hey register yeah man i'm also streaming on um youtube so i got I'm, i've got two streams going i'm multi-streaming at the moment i've got youtube going and I've, I've got twitch going and i'm being asked some questions over on youtube and uh one one gentleman over there yeet do you think you would accept a tadpole in real life pro cool powers con look like a squid ah Nah, I don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't think I could. I mean, unless you're accepting the, you know, tadpole came with a big pile of gold. I mean, you know. But knowing our, knowing our luck, if we did accept the tadpole and became a squid, 
some some weird ass government scientist would probably want to study us. So you pretty much end up spending the rest of your life in hiding, I think. <laughs> That's a very good question. Hey, Unyielding, thanks for coming in, man. Looking ahead. All right, here we go. Now, it was kind of like, uh, but then again, if you were a mind player, you, you could pretty much, you know, manipulate anybody, really, mind-wise. wonder what's past this. Nice, thank you guys. All right, uh, I wonder, oh yeah, I better do a save just in case. Hey fam, Dizzy, of course. Everybody's welcome here, you know? Um, I said I really don't talk about politics or anything, kind of keep my channel to a, uh, where everybody can just kind of chill, relax and stuff, and people need to be just kind of cool with each other. I had a couple of trolls earlier, and they just instantly got the ban hammer, so. Pipes and pumps. That must be how they keep this basement dry, though it's clearly below harbor level. Yeah, you, this is uh, Baldur's Gate 3. Uh, this is Reyna. She is a drow paladin. She was a dark urge. Basically, you know. And uh, basically, she refused, refused Ball. So now she's a good paladin. And uh, the uh, wings are the angel wings. And you, you should be able to get those through the in-game mod manager now. And, um, but there is a race that they do have, um, which a developer, modder created called the Asimar, Asimar, like you said, but, um, yeah, so she's a good paladin and she got her wings. <laughs> so basically she's a drow, drow paladin, like Minthera here. Not sure. Let's see. Let's see. If there's anything? Nope. I don't think there's anything in there. <laughs> nice. Thanks for the sub, guys. Still alive, so that's progress. Nice, thank you. Hey, instructive. 
Sure, why not? Father, they will die for you. I have such a headache. Easy, Raina. There you go, Mr. Instructive. <laughs> nice, I express solidarity with all the chatters. Nice. Hey, Emily, welcome in, welcome in. Thanks for joining. Yeah, I love the wings, you know, it's just, you know, couldn't help myself. And, uh, yeah, I've got a tiefling also. She is a uh, sorceress and a uh, warlock. Very fun class to play. Oh, Good. come on. I was just starting to miss the sound of your voice. So I accidentally click on Shadowheart quite a bit. So. Where is this? All right, we're going to explore. Hey, D Res, welcome in. Truly, this petty. Oh man, now we're in the Undercity? Okay, like I said, this game always presents something new. Uh, no, I, I don't. I haven't played D&D since high school, which was many, many, many moons ago. Do you? Hey, have a good night, Lord Wing. Take care. Thanks for coming in. Appreciate it. Oh, hey, uh... Hey, played. Oh, are you talking about my background picture of her? Yeah, that came, uh, believe it or not, that came off of X... Grok. All I typed in was, uh, make me a photo of a uh, drow female paladin. And there you go. <laughs> you're you're absolutely right, you absolutely right, you know? Accidents happen. But um yeah, if you if you go on X go under grok and you type in make me a photo of like a high elf paladin um it'll pop that up make me a photo of a female drow paladin and yeah um so there's just like i'm not that uh i'm not that good with artwork Thanks, Blade. Ooh, infernal metal. That'll be good for, uh, what's her name? Carlac. This is the fight. All right, we're going to get down there. So yeah, we got to take this guy out if I remember correctly. Droxy. Uh -uh. 
I don't understand you there, Plane. I'm talking about, uh, is she a drow or, uh... What's this? You ain't supposed to be down here, mate. You spot a curious metal contraption in the water. A submersible. All right, number one, that submersible. Why is it here? What is this place? Deception. Boss sent me to check up on the situation down here. Intimidation. I have questions. You have answers. You killed one of the servants of Umberly. Now they want you dead. I'm here for the Duke. Old Ravenguard, take me to him. Um, we're gonna go number four. Hey, hey. Thanks for the sub. Oh, yeah? And are you here to make good on that? I just want to know what happens in this port. You killed someone, you need to face justice. She is a paladin after all. And you're the judge, jury, and executioner, is that it? Yeah, right. Say goodbye, kid. Oh, Gale's up, okay. All right, Gail. No, Madeira's up. I seek an advantage. She within range? Yeah. See what we can. Maneuvering, wonder if she's got disarming. Trip. Yeah, let's see if we can disarm this guy. Nice. Let's get him again. Get him one more time. Oh yeah, you can jump. Definitely. Nice, nice. Thank you, thank you. Let's see if we can trip this guy now. Uh, there we go. Oh, he's already down. All right, Mentor. Leave Take some for the others. The dance of death. Dang, Reyna, you went like a uh, psycho. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the sub. Bam dizzy. Thank you, thank you. Moving in. All right, we avenge this dude. We can we can we can we steal the submarine? I've always wanted to steal. Hey fam, yeah, I appreciate uh, I appreciate the subscription and stuff. So. Thank you, thank you. That's my uh, Twitch channel. Definitely appreciate it, thank you. Yeah, there's a bit of a delay uh, on, on the internet tonight, so. I appreciate everybody that, that that's here chatting. A couple times should do it. Hanging out. <laughs> Absolutely, Wyatt. Yes, you are. You're my number one fan. I, I appreciate you too. And, and uh, like I said, you guys are putting me on the spot here and you're giving me a hard time, which is all good. Appreciate you all. And uh, appreciate my lurkers, my ones that 
Cat ones that don't tap. Appreciate all ya. It's all good, you know? We're all here to chill, relax, have some fun. Yeah, we can actually, uh, we can actually steal the guy's, uh, submarine. Uh, okay. Ah. Oh, another book. All right, so we took out the bad guy. And let's see if we have anything in our journal here. To read. Oh, nice shield. Send that to camp. Arlock, actually. Ooh, shiny. Pretty. Camp. Send that to camp. So yeah, the only problem is there's uh, not great management of the bags, so. Thank you, Holy MP. Appreciate that. Appreciate the sub. Holy MP. Come on. There you go, Reyna. Yeah, sometimes she just kind of gets confused, doesn't know which way to go, you know, or just climbs on boxes for no reason. I, I, I just go with it, you know? Best thing you can do at that point, I think. We're gonna head out of here, go turn this quest in. Uh. Wow, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. It seems, uh, seems when you hit your, seems Twitch has done a little bit of work here, Wyatt. Where, Let's get going. as you hit your sub goals, it automatically updates. Hey, thanks, Holy MP, appreciate it. It automatically updates. So the old days of where you had to set your goals manually no stop me yet. are, are, are kind of gone, which is nice. You know, because like I said, I have a serious case of CRS and um, you know, basically can't remember stuff or, uh, you know, SHIT. And so it just it automatically updates, which is kind of cool. So Twitch has done some good stuff. And now we got to now we got to leave here.
and go turn this quest in. Then at that time, it'll be time for a little bit of a stretch break and time to get another uh, beverage. At least things have stayed interesting. Right, Raina? Definitely interesting. How you doing, man? Welcome, man. First time chatter. Glad you're here. Thank you, Euro for Euro Gamer for the uh, subscription. How you doing, uh, Tyrex? Is it Tyrex or T Rex? And we're kind of stuck here, I think. Where are? Oh, I'm. I don't think I've been on this side of the docks. Thank you, sir, for the follow and stuff. Appreciate it. Mm. Euro Gamer. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thanks for the uh, community sub gift. I'm just curious. Oh, we can do it. You've been caught lurking around the Sword Coast's most secure bank without permission. The guards are understandably upset. Whoops. <laughs> Don't do that. Call it tired. Oh, I bet. Thanks, Tyrex slash tired. Thanks again, Eurogamer. Yeah, uh, let's see if we can persuade this guy. Ooh. Oh no. Tough roll. There we go. Nice. You are permitted to pass with your legs intact. This time. It just sounds like you might have some coins to spare. Just a few. Ooh, that was a close Please. one. See, it's what happens when you have wings. They get you in trouble. Alright, so we have to... Flying cargo. Ah, yes. Hmm. Hey, thanks, Tyrex. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Raina gets herself into quite a bit of trouble at times, just by exploring. Hey, Pixel. Thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. Actually, I also have a uh, character that's a pixie in the game also, so... Let's see if we get into a fight here. Alright. 
Yeah, you know, so. Yep, rain has been here before with all the carnage and blood stains and stuff like that, so you can see. But uh, yeah, we're, we're gonna go ahead and turn this one in. We'll do a save and then we'll take a little break to stretch, get another beverage. Let's see. Untaken, okay. Please head inside. Don't let me keep you from the celebrations. All righty. Who is this guy? Something's on my mind. Did you hear the wave servants talking about a beast in Grey Harbor? If that's true, prayers are the least we can do. Right? Okay. I think we talked to her. Is it done? Have you slain the Beastmaster? Oh, don't glitch out. <clears throat> oh, shit. Okay, so it just got stuck. All right. Umberly smiles on us all. Thank you for enacting her blessed vengeance. May the tides crush his bones to sand. As promised, the Wave Mother rewards those who submit to her will. May the seas be as kind as you deserve. Oh, nice. Of course, her inventory is a disaster at the moment, but that's okay. All right, uh, let's see, what do we got? Okay. Nice. So we have we have all the pieces to him, but we're missing one because the game bugged out and we can't turn that one in. This one, I believe, res rescuing him. These two are down in the Iron Throne Room. Um, all right. Well, we're kind of wrapping this up, so. Yeah, we're gonna go go ahead and take a short break here. <clears throat> and that's where we need to go. Ah, well, welcome in, uh, registered. Oh, no problem, man. Yeah, I know that, um, on a different playthrough, that if you let him live, there's additional scenes and stuff like that that, um, you get. But yes, you're absolutely correct. So... Hey, Oli MP. How you doing, man? Uh, registered to help. Yes, I know about that. 
and yeah if you let him live he i think he leaves a journal behind explaining everything about gortosh and so forth and, and so forth so yeah it's, it's pretty cool um now we're gonna try to break into the foundry here in a few minutes and uh go from there i'm not surprised the water's been grimy as anything recently haven't had a clean catch in a tender <laughs> Hey, Shrub HD, uh, my stream, you don't like it, you don't need to come by, so. Can't give up now. I'm just. <sighs> Ban that, dude. So. And like I said, uh, it's break time. Make sure you guys get up, stretch, get some water, get a beverage, get a snack. And I'll be back in a few minutes. So it's going pretty good, Holy MP. Hey, thanks a bunch. Green tea, appreciate that. But we will be right back in a few minutes. So we're going to go get something to drink. Then we're going to go ahead and try to take on the foundry. Oh. Ooh. Let's go. Open that up. 
what to do all right we are back and like i said uh just had a stretch do a bio break and get myself another drink turn the camera back on you know crs kicking in kind of and uh yeah green tea it's basically the gith yankee armor that's been dyed gold and the wings are the angel wings so and uh yeah we're back but uh before we begin this next quest here um we have a package arrived earlier today and i think we're going to go ahead and open it up on stream and it came from uh elder scrolls online of course they do the fish very no I think I purchased this last year when their expansion pack came out for, uh, oh, let's see. Uh oh, I'm going to have to fix that. Let's see. Anyway, let's go ahead and open it up. And I'm totally dark. Now, sharp object, always go away from you. Oh yeah. Hey, green tea. Yep, they're 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 definitely mods. Ooh. Those are the mod names. There, it's the. It's Yankee armor, and it's the um, mod is called the camp outfit pack or something like that. And then you got the angel wings. So let's go ahead and see what we got here. Oh, wow. Look at this, holy, holy cow. All right. So, I ended up getting this, purchasing this. Let's see if I can, my camera will pick it up. And it is not. See if I can fix this here real quick. There we go. Wretched thing, pull yourself together. All right. So this is the Elder Scrolls Online point set and it's and i hate this web camera at times there we go kinda alright i'll have to here. I fished these waters my whole life. Something's going on down there. Bet my net on it. This is what kind of happens when you try to open stuff up here. Streaming and playing the game. Sometimes it works fine, and other times it just 
Not so well. All right. It's the filters. All right, there we go. As well, it ends not as bad as it could have. All right, let's see if I can get this up here. I had to turn off one of my filters. Let me move the mic out of the way. So yeah, this is the ESO collector coin set. So it's it's pretty darn large as you can see. I'm pretty leaned all the way back in my chair. Yeah, this is it. So it's it's tenth year anniversary. So it's it's pretty cool. It's pretty darn large. You can see. That right there. So the cats can play with it and and mess with it. Hey, Kayla. Nice to meet you, too. Thanks for coming across the stream, and uh, thanks for joining. Uh, Miguel, uh, is this the quest where we murder the city? I think we can. So I think that's part of it. I think we have that option where we become uh, become like a steel watcher or something like that so i i think that's part of it we get caught up here hey why yep 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 like i said that thing is uh like i said what i ordered last year for the 10th anniversary video so it, it's it's pretty darn large it, it's yeah pretty much two feet by two feet so trying to get it to fit on web camera it's pretty crazy but yeah miguel i think you're right all right so let's do a quick save here See, she just likes to climb on top of stuff, you know? Yeah, we're going to end up having to fight one of these steel watchers anyway. So... Actions have drawn the ire of someone nearby. A fight is inevitable. Oh, dang. All right, my turn. Always attack from behind if possible. All right. It is hammer time. Oh, damn. She knocked him on his ass. Nice hit, Mentera. Smash him. Again. Nice. Nice. I like this. I'm actually winning. What's he got left? Oh, these guys though, they go, they go, they go uh self-destruct mode. Taking up position. Get out of the red, remember. Red equals dead, so get out of the red. Striking distance. Retreat. Stay focused. 
Uh, come on, Shadow Heart Baby. Really, really, Shadow Heart, you're 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 standing by a bunch of explosive barrels. Not a good spot for you. Um, it's okay. I've planned for this. There we go. Yeah, Kayla, it's it's definitely a fun game. Uh, definitely involved. Uh, it, it can it can be frustrating at times. So much for peace. Yeah, we're getting away from the uh, smoke barrels. <laughs> See? Hey, Jelly Belly, thanks for uh, the subscription on Twitch. Something's going on down there. Oh, wow. That's that's pretty impressive, Green Tea. Their tactician's pretty tough, too, you know? A good night's sleep would do me wonders. Oh, quit your complaining, Gail. All right. Who's next? All right, so we tried the... Proceeding. That's my key. Mm -hmm. How many die today? How many die tomorrow? All else fails, uh, smash. Now, this is pretty cool. So I'm, I'm looking over to my left here, and they have all the coins from all the expansion packs that Elder Scrolls has done. Wish I could show it better. I mean, it's beautiful artwork. <laughs> uh, I still haven't been able to beat honor mode, huh? I take it it's kind of frustrating. Don't waste a step. Oh. Oh, goes right after the wizard. Oh. Yeah, I haven't played honor mode yet. All right, Gail. Uh, let's see. See if we can nail him with some fire. Nice, nice. Good hits, good hits. Uh, I think ice works good on him. Oh, immune to prone. Yeah, I haven't done tactician yet or honor mode. I try to uh, uh, play games that don't frustrate me. I try to relax with them, you know? Okay. Hey, Kayla. Let's see, what is everyone's favorite race and class and stuff? I could definitely use advice and recommendations going forward. Um, I like playing paladins and uh, uh, sorcerers, you know, casters. And the nice thing and let's see race i like the tiefling race and i like the drow because uh they get dark vision which allows them to see in the dark which helps out a lot and like with certain stats for example like with uh let's see like charisma you can see here 
Uh, paladins, sorcerers, and warlocks. That's their main stat is the charisma. So, you know, you can, if you play on balance mode or above, you can dual class. Uh, and they're like, let's look at Reyna here. Can't even catch my breath. So Reyna is strength. So for her, they like uh, fighters and barbarians is their main, what could be their secondary class, which would complement them very well. Uh, wizards are kind of off by themselves, intelligence. And then I think wisdom is for clerics. Yeah. So you can hover over their main stats. Um, sense intuition, improves spell casting for clerics, druids, and rangers. So when I do a caster, I choose a sorcerer slash warlock because they they use the same stats so I, I like to build up their abilities when, when you get the option for their feats and stuff like that all right you up girl nice hit oh retreat Nah, you're you're probably gonna get taken out, Dale. Fresh orders. Yeah, get out of the red. Ooh. Still breathing, despite everything. So yeah, the steel watchers, you get them down a certain amount of health, then they explode, and that's kind of it. <laughs> Um, yeah, there's there's definitely how-to guides and build guides out there on YouTube for, you know, like, if you like melee, then you're going to want to go with a fighter, barbarian, or paladin if you find trying to be at a distance um, more fun, like a caster, like Gale here. He's a wizard. And um, he, he stays at, tries to stay at distance. So he's got a lot of spells that kind of keep them out of trouble. Wizards are kind of like attack, then move. They're they're not the close up because they die real quick. Whereas like Minthera and Reyna here and Shadowheart, they're, they're, they can be close up and Shadowheart can be kind of further away because like Shadowheart here, comes. she's a I'm cleric. Ready. And as she gets more spells, as you get more spells, she'll get some caster spells, but I mainly use her kind of as a Hulk, you know, smash bash. So, but generally paladins, fighters, and barbarians are um, up close and personal. Um, rogues, if you like stealthy and assassination and stuff like that, uh, rogues generally attack from behind or from hiding and they get a um, massive buff to damage if they are able to sneak up behind a enemy and attack them from behind. So it's it's pretty cool. Um. <laughs> yeah, we don't need that. Is that blood? Never mind. We have, um, at the ready. I think we have some people online that, uh, they, they play bard and stuff like that, but, uh, that's, that's a class that you're going to have to, uh, use the in-game mod manager to download and play, I, I believe. Hey Jacob, welcome in, Guardian man. Guardian artificers might lack a certain worldly wisdom, 
There's no <laughs> doubting they're masters of their craft. You're a child at heart, Gale. Admiring wind-up toys and clockwork trinkets. I admire any who follow their curiosity to novel and unexpected means. This is how the world changes for the better. All right, Gail, you're acting like Elon Musk. Yes. Now that guy, Elon Musk, holy cow, that, that guy is a genius with everything that he's done. Oh, better do a save. All right, we're going to use ready and willing our wizard's ability here called knock. Open sesame. So I have actually never been able to save anybody in this game, this area. like a champ. Hey, they attacked her first. Now we get the key. <laughs> Biggers, right? I'll take that. Let's read what this has to say. Uh, let's see, just a quick note. Da -da -da. Okay, we'll just send that to Mintera. What's inside? Well, this is new. Hmm. What's that? Oh. Not a chance I'll fit in there. Okay, Shadowheart. I'm ready. Whatever it takes. So I dual spec Shadowheart as a cleric and as a druid. So she should be able maybe not. She should be able to transform into a small animal. Not an owlbear. Not a panther. Not that. All right, so the renderer is broken. Because she would turn into a kitty cat. I don't think I'll fit through there. You know what? <clears throat> Wild shape owl bear. Maybe a badger. I don't think I'll fit through there. Uh, okay. Let me, yeah, their renderer is broken. Oh, she's missing a lot of spells. That's not good, especially with the battle that's coming up. Ah, 
Uh, thank you for the hearts. Thanks for the hearts. Yeah, just give me a second here. Just healing word. We might want to do a little bit of that. Don't do that. Natural recovery. Should be a button to dismiss wild form. Maybe it's under common. Yeah. No, all right. Wonder where that went. Ah, there we go. We will. Wonder if Gale's quite ready for you. Let's see. Looking for like uh, wild shape or like gaseous form, you know. Generally, you know. If it is for the. All right, nobody has it. My luck. All right. Keep it together. Right, Rana. We're working on it. Another thing I would recommend you do is save frequently. Uh, just because patch seven came out, the game's been kind of really buggy and stuff. And uh, yeah. guys yeah so I've never been able to save any of these guys I want to have a word you are asking the impossible gyronetics require a steady hand and a sharp gaze I can barely keep my eyes open I need to rest you have a son do you not is he as lazy and pathetic as his spineless mother I beg you. Prinsky's motivation sequence activated. Tell me, Gondian. Tell me about your son. He's not... <sighs> yes, Overseer Holt. He's frail in body and mind like me, like all of us. Yet by your grace, he lives. And your wife? She is... was... Useless and interfered with production quotas. You were wise to remove her from this world. Forgive my outburst. I will work through the night. This watcher will be operational by dawn. I will allow it. But if your work is anything short of impeccable, your son will die screaming. Is that clear? Yes. Overseer Holtz. Oh, dang. That's like from that movie, uh... Gosh, now I am really dating myself from that movie uh, with Arnold Schwarzenegger, Running Man. Wow. Okay. 
so we gotta take these guys out. I am going to just pretty much nuke them. Yeah, you save before every roll. That's kind of cool. I have a tendency to kind of do that too. Just, just stay awake. Let's talk to this guy. God forgive me. I'm awake. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Awake. All right. Uh, let's hopefully let's hope these gondolians stay out of the way. Wonder how many we bad guys we got. Please. Please. Red brother, stand ready. Gondians, so much as twitch, and I'll rip your tongues out myself. You recognize the overseer's uniform. She's a follower of Bane, the god of tyranny. Oh damn. You got that right, Green Tea. We're, we're, it's, it's time it's time to go do some butchering let's see option number one forgive the interruption dread sister i just arrived for duty intimidation i wish to bathe in the blood of these worthless bay knights you can help gondians or you can die intimidation uh let's see Gondians fight back. Do not let these people torment you. Let's see. Persuasion, I'm here to help. Uh, Gondians, together we can free you. Oh man, number five, touch these people and I'll kill you. Uh, let's see. Either way, we just end up in a fight. Uh, let's see. Intimidation. I wish to bathe in the blood of these worthless Bay Knights. You can help Gondians or you can die. Forgive the interruption. Uh, yeah. Well, I've never had any luck on saving the Gondians, so... Hey night, welcome in, man. We're 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 just about in the process to start a very big fight that I've never been able to successfully win. Or I should say win, but I have lots of Gandhian casualties. Alright. I like option number two or number five. Generally, the Gondians just kind of get in the way. And, you know. But, you know, we could use their help. Whatever. Number five. An interloper? You shouldn't be here. Heads will roll for allowing you to pass. Gondians, cut out the interloper's eyes. Overseer, please. We're engineers, not killers. What happens to the disobedient? Save. Oh, I will damn. do it, Overseer. Forgive me. Oh, man. Wrong option. <laughs> well, I'm thinking if we can take out the, the guards first, maybe they'll turn yellow, you know? Suffer. So, no mercy. Prinsky's motivation sequence activated. No, the motivator! Deactivate it! Hurry! But it, it, 
And how the hell do I deactivate it? Oh, shit. Woo! Hey, thanks, guys. Disarmed and just in time. All right, Mentara, kick these. Activating nuke. So much blood. Oh, Do the smell. So much blood. Hey, hey, hey! Don't, don't be good running off they now. Don't be running. All right. If I hide the corpses, the smell will attract someone. We need to get rid of I these bodies. To of them. Right now. Let's talk to her. You want to help? Then get the hells out of here before you make everything worse. Oh, shut up. I just freed you. Oh, perhaps so incinerate them. Dead. What have I done? They'll kill my wife because of this. You. You made me do this. Breathe. Man. You need to get rid of these bodies right now. You have to get rid of the bodies. All right. If I hide the corpses, the smell will attract someone. I need to dispose. I'm sorry. I didn't want to attack you. None of us did. But this is a disaster. They're dead. They're all dead. Um. Okay. Yes. Killing your captors was the point of this. Relax, they can't hurt you anymore. Congratulations. How does it feel to have a spine? Ouch. That's something I would say at work. Hey, you own. Thank you, man. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. All right. Let's see if we can actually uh, do it the right way. No. You don't understand. The overseers hold more than our lives hostage. They oh. have our families. And if they see what we've done, killing me will only be the beginning. God help us. I could so cut them up. Dead. Or perhaps incinerate them. So much blood. All right, well. What if I get caught? I'm not thinking like that. We need to get rid of these bodies right now. There's uh, so much blood. One problem at a time. Deal with the bodies. Get rid of the bodies first. <laughs> All right, and, and then. If I hide the corpses, the smell will attract someone. I need to dispose of them. Uh, so much blood. Oh, the smell. Yeah. I could cut them up. You, you know, incinerate them. Exactly. You're working a foundry. Get rid of these bodies. And it looks like the foundry is like right down there. Just toss the bodies and they'll be incinerated. Oh my gosh. And, and then what you do is you pour oil on the floor and then you just light the oil and run. Yep. So much blood. The smell will attract someone. All right. Need to dispose of them. Oh, impossible, huh? All right, rain is heavily encumbered. Look at all the crap she's got. Yeah, these guys are like wigging out. It's like, just think about it for a minute. What you need to do is to, um, Throw the bodies in the incinerator, and then, you know, put cat, or, cat litter or oil on the blood, and, and just clean it up, you know? It's like cleaning up oil. It's not that big of a deal. So, I mean, not like I haven't cleaned up oil on the driveway before. Just, you know, 
chill. Yeah. Well, now she's a willing couple. Shit. We need to actually go to a vendor and sell this crap off. All right, there we go. Oh, good idea. Good idea. I wonder if we can. I have it. Cut them off. The smell. Perhaps incinerate them. So dead. I forget corpses. Get rid of these bodies. Right now. I wonder if we can send the body to camp. We don't know where the body is in her pack. Alright. Send this to... Time, Kayla. You're very welcome. Thanks for coming in. Appreciate it. Good idea, man. Good idea. God help me. There's so much. Oh, you can't put him in the bag of holding. Crap. Well, that sucks. Yeah, she's got a lot of crap. Weight issues. Yeah, you can pick up the bodies. I mean, I got, I got, I got one of them right there. You know? The smell will attract someone. Let's see if Gail can pick one up. Oh, uh, Gail is such a sissy. Cut them up. Oh, the smell. Perhaps incinerate them. Way to the nearest library. Wow, he's got a lot of spells. Chiru, thanks, man. How you doing tonight? Eh, yeah, we'll just throw them over here. was an incinerator around here if i hide the corpses the smell will attract someone i need to dispose of them it's going to take us a minute to do this incinerate them yeah great idea green tea Yama, welcome in, ma'am. One problem at a time. 
Oh yeah. Deal with the bodies. Bastards deserved it. Breathe. It's it's uh let's see the the uh, wings are called angel wings, or if you go into the in-game mod manager, they're called. Dispose of them. They're they're called uh, wings unlocked. So, yeah, you know, and cut them up. Oh, she's following us now. What if I get caught? I think she just continuously repeats that. Yeah, wings are angel wings or wings unlocked. So you can do a search on that. You have to get rid of the bodies. We need to get rid of these bodies. And actually, yeah, uh, she's a drow, but I did the cosmetic pack with the hair and the bangs. And uh, the horns, I think horns for all or something like that off of Nexus. So, and this is her armor is just the Gith Yankee and I dyed that uh, gold. So, her, basically her backstory is she's the uh, Dark Urge and um, she refused ball. So she redeemed herself. So yeah, D&D. Oh, that's a nice helmet. We'll go get back. We'll get we'll get that here in a second. So much blood. Oh, and the smell. We've got to be sick. Oh my gosh, we freed you. We need to get rid of these bodies right now. We're not thinking. So we freed them, and now they're all freaking out. Overseer. I did it. I this time. Deal with the bodies. All right. So I guess it just kind of plays out. So much blood. Oh, and the smell. Get rid of these bodies. Hey, thanks, man. Thanks, Yama. I guess we could have just blown them up. Uh, maybe we can take the bodies and incinerate them. All right, Gail, you're up. Mm. Abracadabra. We could throw the bodies in the in the water. Duh. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Time to pack it in for the day, I think. Uh, we're not done yet, Shadowheart. You know, let's okay, you know, if you if you say Yeah. Duh. That's just gonna take us a few minutes to do. I'm wondering though if it's going to cause the game to bug out if we throw no them in. The time. Deal with the bodies. If we throw them in the uh, stuff is. All right, we'll send that to camp. If I hide the corpses, the smell will attract someone. I need to dispose of them. We can't. We can't. We need a vendor. The bodies. No. We're not thinking like that. God help me. There's so much blood. One problem at a time. Deal with the bodies. Oh, it's Gale. Of course he can. We've got to be sick. If I hide the corpses, the smell will attract someone. I need to dispose of them. Hey, we're gonna see if we can. We're gonna see if we can. Uh, I'll toss them in the uh, ocean or something. Could, could, could cause it to bug though, so. We're, we're, it's, it's, we're, we're trying to figure this out. It's gonna take me a minute.
I mean, we already took out the guardians, so. Yes, it's a chasm, so. Still breathing, despite everything. We take him. So that's one down. Must lug my guts through this hell. Dang, girl. Yeah, you, you got some issues. gonna toss them in the ocean and let the fishies have them so but I think blood. I'm gonna go back to a vendor and vendor off a bunch of stuff because she's got a lot of crap in her bags yep yep I am playing dark urge on it we're working on getting rid of it you know too bad that shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times too bad she's a uh, loot goblin and just you know has to loot everything yeah playing a dark urge as a uh oath of vengeance paladin it's been very interesting one problem at a time Deal with the bodies. No, we don't need that guy. So I, I wanted to play the Dark Urge, but also try to play as a the paladin. Corpses, the smell will attract someone. I need to dispose of them. I tr I, I, I started a playthrough as pure Let's Dark Urge them. evil. Oh my god, I have such a hard time with that, making those evil choices. It's just, uh, it's a challenge. One problem at a time. That's one thing I really like about the game is that you can kind of play it any way you want. You know. Okay, so I think until we actually take care of everything downstairs. I could cut them up. I just have a feeling that if we throw this one in the. What if I get caught? No. We're not thinking like that. See? We just put her in the barrel. Kind of like what the mob would do, then we could, like. One you know. an interesting Behind solution. The, corpses, the smell will attract someone. I, so I think the next time I play Dark Urge, because the, the, not the next time, but the time that I'm playing right now, my second Dark Urge, I'm playing an Oathbreaker Paladin. I've, I've 
just got her off the nautiloid. So. So I think, so that's going to be interesting. What is this? Oh. So as an Oathbreaker Paladin, you get, get a little more leeway on doing the evil choices and stuff. gate betrays your presence stranger you don't belong here who are you uh let's see number one uh, i've come to free you i already dealt with some of the bay knights i'm reina i'm here to take down the steel watch why him doesn't matter i'm here to destroy the foundry if i tell you won't you go running to the guards? I'm here for entertainment. Been quite the show so far. Uh, we're gonna be we're gonna do this one. Blackaith! Why? Your presence imperils us all. If any of us attempts to escape, our kin will die. The overseers, they have a contraption. When triggered, it will kill everyone who wears a collar. Uh, let's see. Can't you remove the collars? Everyone who wears a collar is helping to build the steel watch, killing you all may be a good thing. Uh, she's trying to be a good girl now. She's trying to be a good girl. I'll kill all the overseers. Before any of them can press a button in the palm of their hands, you may be quick, but nobody is that quick. Oh, I don't like where this is going. You underestimate the enemy. The overseers, they are Glicksbran Rakfar. The collars are not only equipped with explosives, there is also a mechanism that alerts the overseers if they're removed. One of us may be able to save themselves, but it would be at the expense of everyone else. We can't risk it. Uh, wow. Okay. What? Looks like we're going to be doing a mass butcher of everything down here, as usual. Even if we did somehow unshackle our collars simultaneously and overthrow our oppressors, there would be consequences. Our families are held elsewhere. The Overseers need only activate those contraptions they hold, and they suffer the consequences of our actions too. We cannot win. We must aid in building these Vagun. Let's see. There's always a way where you fight back if I free your families. The Steel Watchers are tools of oppression. Building them makes you complicit with the oppressors. It's selfish to value your families more than an entire city. Okay, so it looks like they're forcing us down the storyline of having to go down to the Iron Throne. So. Looks like we're going to be doing that. Gun, gun. I, even more, I'd help you destroy this place. Okay. Where are your families being held? The destruction I can handle. I have a room powder bomb. How do you intend to help me? All right, so that's the first question. I don't know where they are, but some of the overseers must. 
you'll have to infiltrate deeper into the foundry. Just make sure you don't get caught. If they raise the alarm, they'll trigger the collars. I will pray for you. My daughter, her name is Obinia. Gond Ralfraka's Hulnish. May Gond be with you. Patience. It hasn't been long. All right, so. All right, I think what we can do. think on this. Restricted area. Entrance only with Lord Gortash's permission. Violators will be executed. We're going to do a save. I think what we're going to do is we're going to go see if we can I think we're going to go down and uh... Oh damn All right, so we fist You can do better than that. Yeah, I think I kind of screwed up. I think we were supposed to go to the Iron Throne after that, but... Mm. Cutting to the chase. Nice, good hit. She got anything left. All right, we're just gonna hit our new button. I don't wanna hurt this guy. Okay, so we got... Yeah, that was a screw up. That was a screw up. That was definitely a screw up. We should've gone to the Iron Throne after that. Now they're all hostile towards us. Like I said, I've never. Good point. Good point, green tea. On your command. Understood. Ah, that's right. Passive mode. Good point. Sorry, it's just, you know, so used to playing the Dark Urge where you just, you know, annihilate everything. And she don't have none. So you're basically saying we got to be like a like a rogue and sneak around. He's kind of dirty. All right. I get what you're getting at.
Oh, now we got now we got the steel watchers on us. All right. <clears throat> Was really lackluster and not very impressive, Gale. Wow. All right, let's see if we can just get Shadowheart to knock him out. No mercy. Good point. Holy shit, that's a lot. Oh! And then the Steel Watcher killed him. We got the whole place on us. Make sure, let's see. All right, we're gonna do a lot of knocking you out. The wrong fight for okay, good hit, good hit. Get him one more time. Brinsky's motivation sequence activated. Oh shit. That was close. I got the key. We deactivated that. All right, uh, what do we got left? Uh, let's see. I'm good. Yes. All right, Mantera. No. Mercy. Smash. heavy boy I just create problems for myself my boss is right my boss is absolutely right then we can pick this guy up I thought he was a Gondian. Does she have anything left? Uh, she. No, no. Alright, Gail. Now, now's your time to, like, uh, kind of shine? Maybe? Maybe not. Don't. 
That was a dud. care is not to, not to take out the Gondians if we can so we got to take out the iron the fist the iron dude the fist oh they're brainwashed see that oh blurred but yeah we got to take out these dudes Come on, man. Got to dodge, you know? Got to dodge. Boy, they're sure, sure whooping up on him. All right, so... Paladin time. That's right. It's a Gondian. We're going to take him out. Now ah, she's encumbered again. Damn, I really need to empty my bags. All right. This is, this is going better than I thought it would, you know? But yes, I, I think um, let's just drop these items. Or send a couple to Minthera. I think green tea is right. Best way is to sneak through this area. And then, uh... Okay. Gonna need to knock him out, make sure my passive for knockout is active. All right. And she's out of actions. That's okay. Unleash me. Yeah, Gail could use a little help there, Mentera, so. The backbreaker. Oloth Plin Dust. Simple work for nimble fingers. 
Woo! That's close. Uh, actually, I think I'll hold off on whacking him. But we will definitely try to trip attack this guy. Ah! Knocked your ass on your ass! Allow me to demonstrate. So Concentrate. She's stuck? Well, I don't know what's going on with her. Oh yeah. She's maimed. She's stuck. So now I'm just gonna knock these guys out. Oof, man. <laughs> you know, these guys are really irritating me now. I know where we're gonna pick this up next Saturday. <laughs> I think you can take me on. Maybe we should have just, you know. Maybe we should have just sent one person in. I thirst for combat. Right away. That's what I think we should have done. Yeah, I think we should have just done the invisibility potions and stuff like that and snuck by. Where's this last dude? Oh, I see him. What path lies before me? All right, now this guy's irritating me. No shot. Ready for battle. Onward. Thought with the weave. Let's light them up. We can get you a clear shot, hell yeah. Yeah, we kind of screwed that one up. So I think we'll, uh... Well, we'll probably pick up where we did our quick save next Saturday. Because, uh... Yeah, I'd like to try to save all these guys. Can you get, get you in this right spot see if we can uh, put an arrow
Oh, uh, still one left? Oh my gosh. All right. On my way. No idea where he's at. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, now that I know where they're all at. Yeah, well. My victims await. I will not fail. Victory is assured. Night to King Five. Really, Gail? Now, let's get one more in them. Can't afford to let up. Prince's motivation sequence activated. Warning sequence trigger imminent. Another one down. Tired of you. Well, that could have gone better. That could have gone way, way better. All right, so since uh, we've been at this for two and a half hours, I usually stream for about two hours. Walk in death. We are going to go ahead and probably call it right about here. I wonder if we can, nope, wrong area. Oh, control, control center in any chamber. That's kind of creepy. All right, yeah, we're definitely going to uh, redo that scene next Saturday. Because uh, I'd like to be able to... Do this without taking out all the Gondonians. Kind of do it the right way. That was just, uh, you know... Pure slaughter. Yeah, I obliterated everything. Didn't want to, but uh, I'm gonna definitely take your advice, Green Tea, and uh, I would do anything to hug you again. Load up on invisibility potions and maybe respect Gale, and at the same time, before I head down that stairs, through that door, exit, and uh, sell off a bunch of junk. <laughs> so, but. Uh, yeah, that's great advice, man. So pretty much, I'm trying to play Reyna as the hero, you know, since she got redeemed and stuff. But, yeah. I, uh... Help is coming, Obinia. I don't know if it makes it... I don't know if it makes any difference or not. I'm going to go back in and see if there's actual, like... Probably is, you know? Yeah, that's, that's good advice. 
So as you can see, I pretty much obliterated, obliterated everything and... Oh boy. Didn't want to do that. But now we're at the control room. And, uh... Yeah, no biggie. I, now I know. I think I know exactly what to do. Take out the overseers first. But, uh... Still in control, just... <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. Oh, Everywhere. So, yeah, I've been at this for about two and a half hours, and I'm going to go ahead and end the stream here. And I appreciate everybody that came out, my chatters, my followers, people that subscribed and everything like that. Mm, much appreciated. And um, thank you again, everybody. Appreciate it. Thanks, Green Tea, for the advice. And uh, I'm going to load up on invisibility pots and see if I can do this the uh, better way I would say next Saturday night 7 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time and that is going to be a wrap so thank you all and have a great weekend there is no other way